overcoming the invalid zip code error message. Hello everyone. In today's video, we're going to tackle a common problem you might encounter when filling out online forms, the invalid zip code error message. If you're frustrated and wondering what to do, don't worry, you're in the right place. We're going to walk you through some simple steps to fix this issue. Why am I seeing this error? The invalid zip code error message can be caused by a variety of reasons. It's possible that you've mistakenly entered your zip code incorrectly, or maybe the system doesn't recognize the zip code because it's out of date. In some cases, the website or application you're using may have specific formatting requirements for the zip code field. How can I verify my zip code? Before you do anything else, it's important to confirm the accuracy of your zip code. A quick search on the internet can usually provide this information. You can use websites that provide postal information services to confirm the exact and current zip code for your area. Checking zip code format. Different countries use different formats for their postal codes. In the United States, for example, a zip code typically includes five digits, but there's also a nine digit format, commonly known as the zip plus four code. In the UK, on the other hand, postal codes are alphanumeric and have a different structure. So, when entering your zip code, ensure you're using the correct format required by the system. If the system requires a zip plus four code and you're only entering the first five digits, this could be causing the error message. Refresh or reset the form. If you've verified that your zip code is correct and in the appropriate format, but you're still getting an error, the next step could be to refresh the page or reset the form. This can help clear any minor glitches that might be interfering with the form submission. Reach out to customer support. When all else fails, your last resort could be reaching out to customer support. They should be able to guide you through the process or, in some cases, even manually override the error on their end. We hope this video has been helpful in dealing with the frustrating, invalid zip code error. Remember, the key steps are to verify your zip code, check that you're using the correct format, and don't hesitate to contact customer support if you're still having trouble. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.